everyone. Craig's going to get out there magazine at the 11th annual Run for the Toe. At the start of the 50k race. I run for the Toe with my buddy Dave. We're doing the 25 kilometer race today. We're going to show you these beautiful trails at Pinehurst Lake Conservation Area. This race is made up of 12 and a half kilometer loops. We're just over 2k in. First couple k was running on roads through the campsites and now we're on the trails. About four and a half k in, coming up to the first aid station. Okay. You're on water. Let's yeah. ride that view, Dave. Fantastic, beautiful timing. And here's one of the many climbs throughout this course. All right, just over 11 kilometers in, and we're coming up to the steepest hill in the course. Let's get up there, Davey. Round one. Here's a good technique. All right, we're through loop one. On to loop two. 111. With the running all done, one of the benefits of this race is heading down to the beach into the water to cool down. One of the best things about Run for the Toad is the meal afterward. It's gourmet. Let's go take a look. This year, the expo and the dining area were combined under one massive tent. There was lots of seating and additional tables outside. The menu included a number of delicious salads, coleslaw, pasta, lemon ginger chicken breast, drinks, and pie for dessert. The meal was included for all entrants, and spectators were able to pre-purchase their own meal ticket. The race kit included this great bag from Montreal and a number of goodies, including a jar of Ontario's own pear puree. And here's a look at the cool finishes medal. Wrapping things up here at Run for the Toad. Had a great time again this year. Peggy and George do such a great job, such attention to detail, great facilities. And for me as a family guy, it's great to know that Thunder Tree Cinema is there. Uh, when I crossed the finish line, the first thing the kids wanted to do was show me all the crafts they'd made and tell me about how they went hunting for salamanders. And well, they said it's the best race they've ever been to. So that says a lot, and I kind of agree. This is Craig for Get Out There Magazine. Hope to see you out there sometime soon.